Hi everyone, thank you for watching this video. Well, basically I was having uh, an issue with this computer. I'm going to show you the issue right now. Right now, of course, um, it's working, but uh, this is what it, it was doing to me. So I'm going to take you to the problem, okay? Okay, as you can see, this is um, a gaming computer. You see, basically, uh, it has, um, it's an iBuy power computer. It's a very good computer. Uh, as you can see, the problem right here, I'm sorry, I had to put some light. This is basically the card reader. I disconnected it all. That's why it, it, it was actually working. But I'm going to put it back. Okay. And this is what is going to happen if you have the card reader connected. It's, I turn on the computer right now. So basically now we're, I'm going to take it to the screen. As you can see. You see. You will see some letters 9C. Okay. Or sometimes you won't see anything basically. As you can see, you don't see anything. Um it shouldn't take you know more than ten seconds to load up. We already more than ten seconds. So what I'm gonna do? Of course what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna what I did basically um of course hold the power button for ten seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It should turn off. And now we're gonna disconnect the the car reader what it does basically we're disabling the car reader from the computer so now we're gonna turn it back back on again as you can see we're gonna turn it back here and now we look at the screen all right you see now you see you see there you go so basically this computer was giving me that issue now uh, the issue of um, the screen staying there, I will get different different letters, um, A, um, sometimes D, C, so it, different different letters. So basically, the, uh, my whole point, um, the computer was starting. So um, uh, what I did, I disconnected the card reader, and basically, you know, now the computer is loading up. Of course, what I did also to this computer, I had to replace the, um, the CPU fan. This is the, this is the CPU fan, as you can see. I had to replace it and basically I replaced the whole part in the computer because the computer was overheating. So now the computer is up and running, as you can see. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching.